Change your app icon for your Flutter app and this works for iOS and Android. In case you want to publish your app to the App Store or to the Play Store, then it is time to change your app icon and therefore we want to create a custom launcher icon. If you are new here, subscribe to my channel and make sure to watch this video till the end. To add your custom launcher app icon, you go to the pubspec jaml file and then you go to the dev dependencies and here you add your Flutter launcher icons dependency. And lastly, you also need to add here this Flutter icon statement and here you can basically set an image path of your app icon and I set it here to assets icon png, which I have stored here within our assets folder and then I have here this icon png, which I want to have as an app icon. And next to the image path, you also need to supply here Android and iOS and you both set it to true. And this will make sure that we generate our app icon for Android and iOS. And now really important is to also save here this file. And then you should see here Flutter pub get is running. And after this, we go to the console and here inside we need to navigate to our Flutter project. So make sure that you are here within the root folder of your Flutter project in the console. After this, you need to get the dependencies if you haven't yet. And then you need to execute the command flutter pub run. And after this, you need to write flutter launcher icons main. And then you press enter. And after this, you should see that he has generated successfully our launcher icons. And then you can run your app on Android and you go outside of the app. And here inside of all the applications, you see then my launcher icons, which I have defined. And this is exactly this icon, which I have chosen for our launcher icon. And the launcher icon works also on iOS. So simply go outside of your app. And then you see we have here also our launcher icon. Now let's talk about some pitfalls you can run into. The first problem can occur for your launcher icon on iOS. And here it is important that you remove the alpha channel of your image so your image cannot have any transparency. And I want to quickly show you how you can fix this. So let's say you have here an image and this has then some transparency. In macOS you can see it if you open the file details of your image and here you see we have this alpha channel set to yes and we need to have it at no. Therefore, you can open your image with some program and here on macOS, you can simply export your image and then make sure that you untick this alpha channel and save it again. And then you can use this image which you have saved. And this new image doesn't have the alpha channel anymore then. Another problem can occur during the step of generating our app icons. And therefore, I simply recommend you always to type before you generate your app icons flutter clean. And after this, you write then flutter pub get. And lastly, you run this command to generate your images. And lastly, I want to show you how you can add app icons separately for Android and also for iOS. Therefore, you go again to your pub spec jaml file and here you can add then this image pass Android. And this is pointing then to this icon Android image, which I have here inside. And this image looks then like this and this will be only for Android. And secondly, we can also put here this image pass iOS inside and here I point to a different file icon iOS and this will be then for the iOS platform. After this, make sure that you save here this file again. And now we need to generate our icon again. And as a small tip, you can also write everything in one command. So you don't need to write three commands. And I will also put this command into the description of this video. And then you run it. And now you should see here for iOS this new app icon. And this is exactly this icon which we have defined for the iOS platform. And also if you run it on Android again, then you see here our new icon. And this is exactly this icon which we have defined for Android. Hello everyone, thank you so much for watching this video. Please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel here to get the latest news about Flutter. And see you soon, bye.